Saracens round 11 meeting with Worcester Warriors would present them with an opportunity to return to the top of the Gallagher Premiership table. But it was the visitors who settled the quicker, dominating the opening five minutes. And Francois Hugard snaffled the loose ball to feed Duncan Weir for the game's opening score. And only minutes later, 7-0 would become 14. Perry Humphreys cut through the Saracens' defence and then found the returning Ben Teo, who dotted down underneath the sticks. Saris began to string some faces together, only for Man Mountain Will Skelton to drop the ball over the Warriors' line. Owen Farrell reduced the lead to 11 points before a well-worked catch and drive saw Mako Vunipola score the home side's first try of the afternoon. Weir added a further penalty to give the Warriors an 11-17 half-time lead. The first points of the second half came as the game moved into the last half hour. Alex Good starting the counter-attack from deep within his own half. Will Skelton making numerous contributions before the open side. Callum Clark brought the home side within one. Farrell slotted the extras for the narrowest of leads. With 15 minutes to play, David Strattel, who had only been on the pitch for a few minutes, hit Farrell's pass at full tilt for Sarri's third try. As the game approached full-time, both sides pushed hard for the bonus point, but neither were successful, and the final score at Allianz Park stood Saracens 25, Worcester Warriors 17.